I was born twice, first as a baby girl on a remarkably smogless Detroit day in January of 1960, and then again as a teenage boy in an emergency room near Petoskey, Michigan in August of 1974. This is my first date with Julie, but I don't know what to say. Should I tell her about my condition? Would you think I'm weird? So I was wondering if like, and then Jungwoo's hair is like really cute. It all started in Smyrna, with my grandparents, Lefty and Desdemona. My grandma was never wrong in her predictions with her silver spoon, until me. She had a perfect record. I think only 23 fun. correct guesses. Meanwhile, after having my older brother, right, my parents boy. seemed convinced that they would have a daughter. It will be a boy. I guess they were both right in their own way. The doctor said it was 5-alpha reductase deficiency, some genetic mutation I couldn't understand. It told me that all I needed was an operation, and I could go on living as a girl, but I understood the truth. I wasn't normal, I wasn't like everyone else, I was considered a monster, which is why I had to leave. I've never told anyone my story before, but I hope Julie can accept me for who I am. Although the abrupt changes in setting make it difficult to identify main conflicts and lead to an overall messy experience for the reader, Middlesex provides a complex understanding of the immigrant experience gender identity, and finding acceptance in America through the decades. Cal is a soul who inhabits a liminal realm, a creature able to bridge the divisions that plague humanity, endowed with the ability to communicate between genders, this is not with the modern vision of themselves, but in the stereoscope of both.